In his main event time, we are scheduled for 12 three minute rounds for the OBA International Bantamweight title. Introducing first and fighting out of the red corner, he too hails from Nandi Fiji Wise Bula. Weighing in at 53.35 kilograms, the current Fiji Bantam and junior featherweight champion. 11 fights, 10 wins, 7 wins via way of knockout. Suffered his only loss to the world credentialed Aussie Nathan Sting in April. Ladies and gentlemen, Fazon Ali Jr. <laughs> Sat across the ring, formerly from Armenia. He is now based out of Fazon. 170 amateur fights, a 10-time national champion. He represented his native homeland at Sydney 2000. As a professional, he has an unblemished record. 10 fights, 10 wins, 10 knockouts. 53 kilograms, he took the scales. He is the number two bantamweight, with the number two junior bantamweight in the land. The current Australian flyweight champion, ladies and gentlemen, the Raging Bull, Victor <laughs> Gary Dean, the third man inside the ring of judges and ringside, Johnny Couchy, Mick Benino and Anthony Shipley. Right, buddy. Come on, mate. All right, you've had your instructions in the ring. All right, this is for 12, 12 rounds. Championship fight, okay? Treat it with respect, and let's just do as I say, right? Listen to my instructions at all times. Let's go. Set to go for the vacant Oceana Boxing Association Bantamweight title, our feature event from Enmore Trust. You have enjoyed our coverage. Certainly looking forward to Victor Chinian's appearance. Very popular here. Jeff Finnick believes this man is going to a world title. Undefeated in 10 fights. Let's see what he's got. The Southpaw in the black trunks, Victor Chunian. And Fazan Ali Jr. in the orange and black trunks. Well, Victor Chunian is on the improve. I mean, since he's been with Jeff Finnick, since uh, basing himself here in Australia, the guy has done nothing but improve every fight out. I might actually just be a matter of time before uh, Big Dachini catches up with this guy. Well, they're saying that he can get the distance with Nathan Sting. Nathan Sting, a very good fighter, good puncher. So this will be a really, really good, uh, good gauge, good tester for uh, Big Dachini. He's an immensely talented young man. I look down my records and see that he's knocked out opponents with the left hand, he's knocked out opponents with the right hand, he's even stopped opponents with a body attack. Oh, look, very versatile, he's, you know, he can take care of the body, as you say, with, our, with the body shot, or, you know, left or right to the head. Mazzanali well, Jr. needs to get off the ropes, as Victor Chinian works to the body. Yeah, nice and snappy, very quick, he's big, loading up with that big left hand. Self-preservation, the name of the game for Ali Jr. at the moment as Darchinian wails away. He's looking for an early night, Vic Darchinian. Yeah, Fazan Jr. though, he's still in there, he's taking some good shots. But I think it's just going to be a matter of time. Chinian loading up with the left hand, looking for an opening. Yeah, he's just stalking his man, just waiting for that one opportunity. Picture of concentration. He's just waiting for that one home run. The one home run shot that's going to take everybody out of him. Wild shot from Fazan Ali Jr. coming forward. He's covering up well though, this Fazan Jr. Good defensive style. His long arms, elbows getting down beneath the belt line. Trying to protect the rib cage. Darchini and well on top here in the opening round. Well, I think this is the way the fight's going to go. 
unless Vic can get this, this guy out of there. I mean, this guy just doesn't have the skills of Vic. He hasn't got the speed. But he has got a good defense. He's blocking a lot of those shots. Not too many clean scoring punches. Partially deflected, but still with Garcini and well on top here. Concluding stages of the opening round, it's been largely one-way traffic for Victor Chinian. Stop! Fazan Ali Jr., a dual champion in Fiji. Let's listen in with Jeff Benny. Come here again. No, been loose. No one punch try knockout. Work with work punches. No one punch try knockout. Work for one punch. Under, under, left, left, then big punch. No straight away. I can see everything. And after to punch, you jump off. No jump off. Roll up. Go forward. Come on, big. Look good the game. Get up a guard. Lift 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 up a guard. Very, very good in his strategy. He doesn't want his man loading up. He wants him to set those punches up. Threes and fours. Seconds let, down. Let those combinations Round come two. and the big punch will follow. Come on. He's a hard taskmaster, Jeff Fennick. Victor Chinian thought he'd done pretty well in the opening round until he sat down. But here we go, round number two. Victor Chinian, the southpaw and the black trunks. Comprehensively winning the opening round 10-9 against Fazan Ali Jr., dual Fijian champ. He's going to need all his experience here, Fazan Ali Jr. Victor uh, Chinian. The raging bull is living up to his name. He's still stalking his man, just waiting for that oh. opportunity. There you go. He's just yes. setting his man up with that jab. Open his man up. Give him a target, take it away, and then counter punch. That's a good body shot. A yeah, good thumping body shot. But he's covering up well as Fazan Ali Jr. Not a lot of clean scoring shots. Now trying to unload some artillery of his own. He's scored with a nice left hook coming out. <laughs> Must also say a big hello to my beautiful wife, Michelle, watching the fights at home, and hopefully the little fella Nate's asleep in bed. I'll be home very shortly. Hang Fazan Ali Jr. needing all of his defensive skills here against Victor Chinian. Is there uh, also a new addition to the John Casey uh, family household? That's my beautiful daughter, Millicent. Sure, she's asleep. My wife probably likewise. There's an Ali Jr. at the moment, just keeping Victor Chinian at bay with his good defence. Yeah, not doing too much work, but he's making it very awkward for Victor Chinian. Vic just can't get that one big shot in that he needs. What he needs to do, as Jeff has been saying, is to open his man up first. Don't look for that one shot. Ali waving Dick Victor Chinian on. Yeah, Fazan Ali Jr. saying, come on, Dick, is that all you got? Let me see what you can do. And let me tell you, Vic's going to accommodate him. Overhand lock from uh, Fazan Ali Jr. taking on the gloves of Dutch Chinian. Again, Ali Jr. on the ropes, Darcinian looking for an opening and digs to the rib cage. That grabbed the attention of Fazan Ali Jr. again covers up. Fazan Ali Jr. just smiles at Big Darcinian, taking a lot of those, glo those punches on the gloves and elbows. You really can't take that sort of punishment for 12 rounds. That's what we're scheduled for here for the OBA title. Phantom weight division. 53 and a half kilos is the limit. Eight stone six in the old language. At jockey size. There's a thumping right rip to the body from Big Darchinian. Being the southpaw, that's his, you know, his lead hand, the beautiful right rip. 
I think that team has got a lot of supporters here from the Arme Armenian community. They're right behind this guy. And why shouldn't they be? He's got plenty of talent and, um, you know, he's a guy with plenty of promise. He's on his way up. Should be too long before we see Darchinian Second moving down. on to the international Round stage three. and fighting out of Australia. For the moment, let's enjoy it while he's here. The OBA bantamweight title on the line. Pete Darchinian has clearly won the first two rounds against Parzanali Jr. from Fiji. Yeah, we just hope Big Dad Chinin doesn't, you know, lose his head and try and go for that one big knockout. Doesn't want, we don't want him to get discouraged by loading up his shots and not taking his man out. He's got to set his man up. He's a cage of customer, Fazanali Jr. He's presenting some problems for Big Dad well, Chinin. Just, you know, he's rolling himself up in the ball, being a very, very hard target to hit. Good defense. I mean, this could start... Going on later on in the rounds could start to frustrate Vic Darchinian. That's where Vic needs to step back out. Use that jab and open his man up. Make Fezzanali Jr. commit himself. And that was certainly Darchinian's problem, perhaps in his first three or four fights, that he would get frustrated, but now he seems to have matured under Jeff Fennick and realises that he's not going to knock everyone out. No, well, that's right. Well, you can't. You just cannot. It's impossible. You just can't knock everybody out. I mean, and if you go in there to try and knock some, you know, some guys out, all you're going to do is waste your own energy, and you're going to fatigue yourself, and leave yourself susceptible late in a fight. Good intelligent fight so far from Fazanali Jr. as well. Just soaking up the punishment in the early rounds. I'm sure. Well, especially being a 12-round fight, John. I mean, he's going to save, he's going to conserve his energy. And a wicked body shot from Darchinian. You can hear the thud from out here. Certainly the left ribcage of Fazanali Jr. has soaked up plenty of punishment. I'm surprised the body shots send him down either well they'll take their toll slowly but surely maybe the one sh shot's not going to get him out of there working, now he works to the right rib cage of Fazan Ali Jr well, let me tell you the guy can't take too many more of those he's been brave he's taken a lot of punishment VG and champ Almost exclusively defence coming from Fazanali Jr. Well, that could be his uh, his ploy. That could be strategy. He knows there's 12 rounds. He's not going to waste his energy early. He keeps smiling at Big Darchinian as well, including stages round number three. Body shot from Fazanali Jr. Not a lot else on offer from him, and Darchinian has another round in the books. You want to punch Grub, you want to show him punch every time here. Vic, jab, jab, uppercut there, uppercut there, let's get in, what we practice. Under, over, under, over. Come on, keep punching me. No one punch. And jump back off. Every time that you punch, you jump off. Have hands up why do. Come on, Vic, we want to punch for three minutes. Come on. Oh, stop, start. Three minutes, not stop, punch. Come on, no stop. No, punch, 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 no stop. This is how we're going to stop this one. No, we can't punch. Come on, stand up. Three minutes, not stop, punch. Come on, show me. Jeff Fennick laying down the law to Victor Chinny. Second is to go. Round number four. Scheduled for 12. 